<laughs> Good morning, everybody. Ah, I'm getting wet. It's a beautiful morning. A beautiful morning. Ah, oh, I just thought I'd share this beautiful space. It's it's my um, heaven. It's my my space to really love and connect and and spend time just being within myself and getting perspective. Um, I cannot recommend early morning practices highly enough. And by early morning, honouring my health type, this is early morning for me. <laughs> I know, I know, right? It's like nearly nine o'clock. Um, so <laughs> I really wanted to tune in this morning. Hey, John. Um, and have this beautiful conversation about delayed gratification. So many of us... Um, uh, here in life and where we're speaking about what we want, we want to create this and we want to have the ideal company, the ideal job, the ideal tribe, the following, the brand, whatever it is. We all have these uh, goals, visions, ideas that we want to create in life. Um, but at the same time as I say that, there are so many of you out there who are happy to just go to work and Monday mornings aren't a problem for you. And hi, Bruce from Dubbo. Oh, my God, Bruce. That is awesome. I was born in Tamworth, so not far from there. Far, but not far. Hey, Kirsten. Hey, beautiful. Good morning. What a beautiful spot, hey? So, delayed gratification. Like, so many of us are out there trying to create this life, this dream, this vision, all the things that we want to have. And it's okay to sit there and write things down. Like last night was a full moon, so it was totally the space and time to get really super clear on what you want to create and where you want to be in the world and what's coming for you now. You know, if you're into energetics, it was like, oh, the best time ever. And so a lot of us are there visioning and we're writing the stuff. But funnily enough, many of us have this craving for instant gratification, daily gratification. Like, yes, I want it now. I want all of it now. And you know what? That's totally cool. And there are parts of me that want that too all the time. I am human, just like chocolate. And, <laughs> and what I've noticed is that so many of us want that instant gratification, but we don't understand that sometimes it's actually the long game, the delayed gratification that we're not connecting with effectively enough. So sometimes we need to drop the ego and, and accept that maybe I'm not going to have it all right now. You know, sometimes we need to wait just a little bit. It's like, it's like making bread. You know, you roll the dough, you've got to let it prove for a bit. Then you've got to put it in the oven and it needs to bake. Y'all can eat the dough, but it's probably going to give you a bellyache and it's not going to be that great. Whereas if you wait and you allow that dough to prove itself and you allow that um, yeast to brew and rise and then you get this freaking epic, fluffy, crusty bread that you are just like, I'm going to rip it apart, put butter on it and love it. Am I right? Does that make sense? Um, Bruce is asking where I'm at. I'm at Bribey Island. I'm at Bribey Island. I'm sitting here right on the water edge today, a different spot to my normal spot. And so getting back to our bread roll, so looking at proving things, allowing the delayed gratification, there are small wins that you can be aware of. And if you're really not checking in with yourself and you're just doing life and you're not constantly reassessing and evaluating the steps you're taking, what that's doing for you, the momentum that's creating, and the small wins, then you're really not going to actually appreciate the big wins. And it's totally relevant. And we all do this. Like we are all totally human. And what can happen is that we expect the instant gratification, but we're missing out on the crusty bread because we're wanting to eat it now and we're getting this doughy half-baked bread in life and not actually not actually allowing ourselves to go into full proof and full, um, I've gone into a baking term, but this is fine, and full crusty bread. You know, maybe you want some sesame seeds on top or, you know, maybe there's some nice toppings that you really want or maybe you've got a new spread that you want to try it with you know there's all these new things that pop up in life that once we get to the point of what we're trying to create we realize that we actually want more we actually have other opportunities other ideals other um, beautiful splendors of life that we get to uh, then add to our dream but often we we shoot ourselves in the foot and we try to get these instant gratifications often we're not willing to do the long game you know yes i could go out on the weekend and spend time with all these people and do all the fun things right now i can have all the things that i want right now but am i going to get any further than where i am right now anytime soon or is this going to be my constant grazing for the rest of my life am i going to be eating doughy bread for the rest of my life <laughs> 
<laughs> Sorry, I cracked myself up. <sighs> or am I going to sit there and say no to a few more things and allow myself to proof my dough, allow myself to put in the work, knead the dough, do the things I need to now, give up the wants and desires right now so that I can live a life of extraordinary desire, extraordinary creation, extraordinary abundance. We all want more abundance. We all want more wealth. We all want more riches. We all want more health. But a lot of us uh, shoot ourselves in the foot and take the instant gratification rather than playing the long game and allowing ourselves to proof, to rise, to, what does yeast do? It brews. You know, allowing ourselves to, to go through the process of giving up the things right now and fully paying attention to what is required to rise, to bake, whatever you want to put it as a metaphor. <laughs> Take the time and realize that we really do have to um, spend the time and, and go the long game and, and take away the instant gratification and know that the, what is coming for you when you stick in this and you play the long game and you maybe give up some of the wants and desires right now so that you can have the extraordinary life later. Um, what's, that old, what's that saying? It's um, Someone give it to me. It's... You've got to be willing to do what others aren't willing to do right now so you can have what others aren't able to have in the later term. Not quite it, but that's close enough. You get what I mean. So uh, get rid of the instant gratification. Your ego doesn't serve you. Allow yourself to be what you need to. Um, Play the long game and and celebrate the small wins, but don't celebrate too much. Don't go for the instant gratification. Um, And yeah, just allow yourself to be so much more by playing the long game and knowing that you're worth it. Everyone wants to see what I'm where I'm at. Here I am. I'm down by the water. I'm legit about to head into work, but this is my beginning to the morning. So play the long game. The instant gratification is great, but you want more than that. You need more than that. You deserve more than that. So love yourself. Stay at it. And remember that quite often when we take the instant gratification, we're only three feet from that gold. The, the goal, the, the vision, the, the big dream is only a few steps away. So just continue on and, and know that you are here for so much more than just ordinary life. But maybe you are one of those people that is happy with that. Maybe you, may, are you one of those people that wakes up on Monday morning and you think life is perfect and you're in the right space and you're loving what you've created? Are you the person that sits there and you are like happy to be there on Friday and you're thinking about Monday and how awesome it is to have a day job to go to? Hey, Troy. If you're one of those people, then, like, that's awesome. I'm so happy that you're in that space. We need people like you in the world. Like, there needs to be an ecosystem. But if you're not that person, then start really looking. Start really, truly looking to what you're wanting to create and what are you needing to give up right now so that you can have all of that, so that you can have the extraordinary life. Thank you, guys. Have a blessed day.